Let's take a look at Ian Hubert's camera shakeify add-on. Alright guys, how's it going? I hope you're doing very well. Now there is a certain element of preaching to the choir here. I would imagine most people have seen this add-on, but hey, the internet's a pretty big place and we like to review add-ons in this channel. It is available for free, I'll leave the link in the description down below. If you want to check it out, you're more than welcome. And essentially what it does is it adds a kind of motion driver to the camera and it gives you this really nice kind of camera shake. So we'll take a quick look, we'll quickly jump into Blender. Once you have the add-on installed, all you need to do is select the camera, go to the camera options and down the bottom you can see here, camera shakeify. Now you can't really go wrong with this to be honest, it's so intuitive. And all you need to do is hit the plus sign and you can see here we have different shake types. We have investigation, so investigation it kind of very gentle, very subtle movement, nice and easy. We also have the Zeke spaceship shake, so if you're inside the spaceship for example, you have bike on gravel, now, that's a pretty good shake to be honest. Out of a car window, handy cam run, walk to the store, the wedding, the close up and investigation. And if I just select the first one and I hit play, you can see here I start to get some motion in the camera, in fact if I quickly jump into it, nice and easy. So we can control things like the influence, so if we put this down a little bit, you're better going about 0 0.3 and it kind of gets rid of that big heavy shake and that's it and you can actually build these on top of each other so we can hit the plus sign again we'll change this to something like the wedding which I would imagine will be kind of slower we can also change things like the scale, the speed, the frame offset and I think fix all camera shakes is if you get a large movement or maybe you're overlapping different camera types it will kind of try and curve it out just a little bit and that really is the camera shakeify. It's very easy to use, to be honest. It's a great little tool. It saves you kind of buying anything commercial. Now, I know there is commercial things available, and I know there is free add ons that kind of do the exact same, but I think a lot of people will definitely have this installed. Do me a favour, guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, follow me on Twitter. You know what to do. Take care.